Love is more powerful than stability, however, the right love brings stability. To my best friend and soulmate, you are the reason for all that I do. You are the reason I love you so much. You are all I think about. You're the reason every time you walk into the room, I can't help but stare and get lost in your eyes. You are everything to me. I remember when you had your first message me on Facebook. I had sent you a friend request because, you know, you were beautiful and we had mutual friends. I thought to myself, there is no way. We met February 3rd, 2019 at a screwball party. When I saw you for the first time, I knew from the moment I said, wow, you are beautiful, I was going to marry you one day. It was love at first sight, and I was falling head over heels in love with you. Our first date lasted eight hours. What first date last that long? We even met each other's parents on the first date. Hey dad, I promise I'm not gonna mess this up. There's not many things that are perfect, but we are perfect for each other. Baby, I promise to always protect you. I promise to always give you room to be yourself and not change anything about you. I promise to never make a decision for you, but to always make them with you. Because we are a team and have been since the day we told each other this is it. I am so lucky to have you. I am so grateful that you were you brought into my life. Here's to forever, baby, I love you. <laughs> When I first met you, I had given up. I felt that I was not worth loving. I knew my health would always be a hindrance, and because of that, I believed I was too much to handle. After our first date, as soon as I got home, I told Sam that you were the man I was going to marry. Day one of our relationship, I told you I didn't trust you, and that while I'd love to trust you, it would take a long time because I had been hurt so many times in my life. You changed that. You've learned all my disorders, allergies, medications, and doctors. You have stood by me as I was diagnosed with ADHD, autism, and PTSD. You have carried me when I was in too much pain to walk. You have helped me bathe when I was unable. You have encouraged me when all I wanted to do was give up. These past few months have been the hardest we have ever been through. There have been many nights I didn't sleep because I wanted to make sure you were breathing. I have carried you, fed you, bathed you, and advocated for you. Not many know about your health, but the night you forgot who I was was the hardest night of my life. It was then that it dawned on me how far I'd come. Not only did I trust you, but I couldn't imagine a life without you, and just the thought of losing you became my worst fear. I expect of myself that you will never walk alone, that I will always be madly in love with you. I will be your biggest advocate. I will communicate with you even when I don't know how. I will teach you over and over how to do house chores because we've learned you can't remember to even do them. <laughs> I will always encourage you to use your voice and speak your truth. I promise to always give you forehead kisses, hold your hand, hug you, and tell you I love you. One set of vows isn't enough to cover a lifetime together and I promise to adapt them as we need. You are my everything, and I can't believe the day is here when I can finally say I miss it, sweet hoss. I love you, baby, and I will never stop loving you. I would like to present to you, for the first time, okay. Mr. and Mrs. Sarah and Brandon Duhoff. The night is glowing true. I feel a million eyes But I can just see you No rain, no thunder It's just your light, your voice The heaven of our kids The wonder of our choice So breathe Welcome aboard you Haas and Short Airlines My name is Captain Robbie Now, if you could all Please secure your drinks up in the air like so. Knowing that there's going to be turbulence, please also take out your cell phone and capture as many embarrassing candidates as possible, then post them to social media. Thank you, Brandon and Sarah. You chose the right flight. I wish you the best. The moon is 
Watching you both grow into the people you've become over the past few years. I am so grateful to have been given the privilege of standing beside my best friend as she starts this new chapter in her life, marrying the man whom she found to put up with her sassy and strong-willed self for the rest of their lives. The love that these two share is undeniable and unbreakable. I know that the last year has not been easy to say the least, but if you can overcome this, you can overcome anything with the strength that I've seen in you both. So here's to a life full of adventure. I wish you laughter, love, and a life full of great surprises. Alrighty. All right, Brandon, 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 where do you begin? It's been 23 long years with you, and you finally got one thing right. You got married. Ooh, I remember all those years of cleaning up after you, and now you finally become a real man. But anyway, welcome to the Sarah, our family, Sarah. And I hope better many years. Brandon and Sarah. It'll be a fun, fun, long time. I wish you all well, and I'll be here forever. Right, right. Mm -hmm.